In this presentation, we are going to discuss about ARM Cortex M4 data processing instruction. We are referring the textbook, definitely go to ARM Cortex M3 and M4 processors from Joseph EU. For much more details, you can refer this book. We are referring to chapter 5. In chapter 5, we are referring the uh, module 5.6.7, which is bit field processing instructions. For further details, you can refer the page number 152 in this book. Bit field processing. Bit addressable instructions and this bit addressable ports are very much helpful for control applications. What do you mean by control? On and off is control. Switch on the lamp and switch off the lamp means logic 1 and logic 0. Open the door and close the door means logic 1 means it lower door closes, logic 0 means door opens. Something like that. Bit set reset operations will help us to do the control operations. Hence, bit set reset operations in the microcontroller architecture. Bit set reset operations in the instruction sets will help us to do the control applications more comfortable. Hence, Cortex M4 has bit set resetable features, bit field uh, set and reset instructions. Hence, Cortex M series of microprocessors are mainly used for embedded, set, embedded system applications, which is focused much, focusing much on control applications, where the switching on and switching off control applications is most widely used. So here in 8051 we talk about bit set resetable. Here we talk about bit field processing instructions. What is the difference between the bit and bit field? Here a group of bits can be set, a group of bits can be cleared. That is why it is called as bit field. So there you can there are instructions to set an individual bit, there are instructions to set a clear the bit, and the bit addressable memory locations are also there, bit addressable ports are also there. Similarly, here Individual bits can be set, individual bits can be cleared. Along with that, a group of bits can be set, a group of bits can be cleared, a group of bits can be inserted, a group of bits can be removed from a 32 bit word, and much more things are possible, which gives more comfortness to the programmers to switch on several devices simultaneously, switch off several devices simultaneously, and a uh, lot more applications can be done more comfortably by using these features let us look at it one by one okay so on cortex m4 data processing instructions bit field processing instructions here so to make the cortex m4 processor an excellent architecture for control applications these processor supports a number of bit field processing operations as listed in the table 5.29 here you can see clear the bit field within a register so within a register you can clear a bit field by using the instruction bfc rd which is destination register hash lsb and hash with so bit field means what how many bits okay so starting from the lsb from which bit we have to start and from the lsb how many bits need to be cleared this is the syntax for bit field clear and bit field insert bit field insert means what uh, in the destination register, we have to insert certain bits. So those bits are copied from the RN register. Okay. So the content of the RN register, the corresponding LSB bit to the corresponding width will be copied and inserted into the destination registers bits. That's very interesting, right? So we'll see some examples for much more clarity. So bit field clear, corresponding field in a corresponding destination registers will be cleared corresponding uh, bit field in the destination register will be inserted by the RN register content bits, something like that. And uh, CLZ means count the leading zeros. The count, uh, to count the number of zeros in the corresponding register, there are some set of instructions which is quite interesting. And the reverse bit order in registers. Reverse this bit order means what? The complete bit order. So early in uh, the previous uh, in the previous instructions, uh, we are reversing the bytes. We are reversing the half words. Now we are completely reversing the bits. That means D15 will become D0, D0 will become D15, D1 will become D14, something like that. So reversing the bit is our bit, uh, bit order in the register and the signed bit field uh, extended. Okay. So the copy of bit field from the source and the sign extended it copy of uh, bit field from the source register which is unsigned and signed okay 
is very interesting. Bitfield extended, unsigned, signed. So first instruction is Bitfield clear. Let us see some example. Bitfield clear clears the non to 31 adjacent bits in any position of the register. Since syntax of the instruction is BFC, destination register, and the last B and with. For example, if R naught equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, F, 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 and the instruction BFC R naught comma hash 4 comma 8. Hash 8 means what? The least significant bit is fourth bit. What is fourth bit? 0, 1, 2, 3, fourth bit. So fourth bit is this F. Then from the fourth bit up to eight bits need to be cleared. So the middle two Fs must be cleared. Why? Because the fourth bit is this. From here eight bits means F00F zero, zero, F should be the answer. Okay. So clear eight bits from the fourth location. This instruction denotes clear eight bits from the fourth location of R0 and they place the same in R0. So after executing this instruction, the R0 register will have 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, F, 0, 0, F. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, F, 0, 0, F. As we see here, from the fourth bit, clear 8 bits. It's very clearly given from the fourth bit, clear 8 bits. So this is bit field clear. And for bit field insert, it's very interesting, right? Copy is 0, 1 to 31 bits from one register to any location in another register, the syntax is bit field insert, destination register, this is the source registers, ALSB and number of the corresponding bits. For example, if R0 is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and R1 is 33, 55, AACC, then bit field insert R1, comma R0. So R1 is the destination register, R0 is the source register and the least significant bit is 8th bit. From 8th bit, 16 bits need to be copied from the source register. Okay, 16 bit must be copied from the source register and pasted in the pasted from the 8th bit to the 16th location. It's very interesting. So, what is the source register? Rn. What is Rn here? Rn is R0. So, R0 16 bit right 5678 is the 16 bit 5678 is the 16 bit which need to be copied and inserted into r1 in r1 from where those 16 bit need to be inserted from the 8th bit so in r1 what is 8th bit cc c is 4 bit another c is another 4 bit this aa phi phi so 16 bit from 8th bit 8th bit is this eighth bit and from LSB 8, total will be 16 bit, right? So A is one nibble, this A is another nibble 8 bit, this 5 is another nibble, this 5 is another nibble, so 8 plus 8 16 bit. So AA 5 5, look at the screen, look at the cursor. AA 5 5 in this R1 will be removed and inserted with 5 6 7 8, and the answer will be 3 3 5 6 7 8 CC. Very clearly it is mentioned, insert R0, 0 to 15th, uh, or 16 bit of R0 to R1, 8 to 23rd bit. So the answer is R1 equal to 3, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, C, C. The count leading zeros instructions. Count leading zeros instruction counts the number of leading zeros. If no bits are set, the result is 32. If all the bits are set, then the result is 0. It is commonly used to determine the number of bit shifts required to normalize the value so that the leading one is shifted to bit 31 which is very, very much used in floating point uh, calculations where so there is something like reverse bit instructions reverse is the bit order in the data word reverse bit source register and destination register so this instruction is very useful for processing the serial bit streams in the data communications for example r naught value is b4 e10 c23 the its binary equivalent is for b it is 1011 for 4 it is 0100 for e it is triple one zero for 1 it is 0001 and for 0 it is 0000 and for c it is 1100 and for 2 it is 0010 and for 3 it is 0011 so reverse bit means this 1100 we reverse completely this 110 is c 
zero one zero zero is four zero zero one one is three so c four three zero something like that you can see c four three zero and this one zero 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 is eight and this zero one 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 is seven and this zero zero one zero is two and one one zero one is d so instead of studying one zero one one is d one zero one one is d and four you have to come from the reverse order one one zero zero is c and zero one zero zero is four and zero zero one one is three and zero 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 is zero and one zero 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 is eight something like this this is reversing the bit okay so then unsigned and signed bit field extract uh, instruction bit field extract so how to extract the bit field unsigned how to extract means it's very interesting right extracting the unsigned bit extracting the signed bit field it's very interesting from the register starting from any location specified by the lsd operation with any width specified by the width operand zero extends it and puts it in the destination register for example if r not value is having 5 6 7 8 a b c d unsigned bit field extract means from r not we are extracting the bit field and then replace placing in r1 from r not what is being extracted from the fourth bit eight bits are extracted from the fourth bit means uh, fourth bit is uh, the c eight bits means bc bc is extracted from r not and then um, kept in r1 because it is byte right so r1 equal to 0 0 0 0 0 0 bc 0 extended of bc way because it is unsigned bit field extraction similarly signed bit bit field extract so among several bits a bit field can be taken out and then kept it in the destination register which is quite interesting right similarly signed bit field extraction extend extracts the bit field but it sign extends it before putting it in a destination register. For example, LDR R not comma LDR that is R not equal to five six seven eight A B C D. So it is uh, it's very interesting, right? Same instruction, right? Same instruction. Here it is extracting eight bits starting from fourth bit in R not. Extracting eight bits starting from fourth bit from R not. Starting from fourth means again same B C extracting 8 bit and replacing it in r1 with sign extension because 8th bit is b so it is sign extended so there is something like compare and text instructions also so the compare and test instructions are all used to update the flags in the apsr register which may then be used by a conditional branch or conditional execution table 5.3 list these instructions so there is something like uh, compare it will reflect only the flags right so compare and uh, compare with the immediate data and the compare negative compare negative with immediate data test means it is best ways and testing the bit means bit ways and and uh, test immediate content and uh, test xr and uh, test xr with immediate content okay so for testing uh, they are using the corresponding instructions which is very useful for us to set a corresponding bit and clear a corresponding bit. Thank you.